everyone. So today I'm gonna make my very first cooking video and today I'm gonna teach you how to make one of my favorite recipes and it's a raw vegan ceviche. Um, I love this recipe because it's delicious and healthy and I love all of these beautiful ingredients that we're gonna be using. The base of our um, ceviche is gonna be cauliflower and then we're gonna use cucumbers and tomatoes and lime juice of course and um, I love spicy food so we're going to be using um, peppers and onions and bell peppers and cilantro. I love cilantro. So I'm really excited to show you how to make this. Let's get started. Come on. Okay, so I have all of our materials laid out in front of us. Um, I've already shredded the a head of cauliflower the size of this one here so it's all in this dish um, looking beautiful. Um, here, let me show you. So that's what it looks like when it's all shredded. And I just used one of these to do it. And it takes about like four to five minutes to do a whole head of this um, to shred it. You just take the back of it off and then you use all the white stuff. <laughs> um, I think you know that way, just in case you don't. Um, and then I have some cucumber here, chopped up, some tomatoes. This is about four to five tomatoes. Um, four cucumbers, some cilantro, um, a few leaves. Um, not all of this, just a little bit of that um, here, and some red onion, and um, about seven to eight lime juice uh, I already put in there to soak the, the cauliflower, because the cauliflower is completely raw, um, and it's only going to be cooked in the juice of the lime. Um, I, this recipe is completely raw, and eating raw, what it does is um, really gets all the nutrients from the vegetables, none of it, the enzymes are um, going to die because there's going to be no cooking involved. So um, once you do that, you um, just gonna mix, put in my cucumber, get it all in there. Then you put in your tomato. Look how beautiful and colorful it is already. The cilantro from my Latinas. You know what this is. Um, red onion and I like to use uh, peppers because I like my uh, ceviche spicy otherwise it's not ceviche so I use uh, serrano peppers but you can use whatever you want um, your favorite and then some salt I'm gonna have the measurements and the information below how much I use of everything but I don't really use whenever I'm cooking a recipe I don't really use I'm not very strict with how much I'm using um, I just kind of feel it because sometimes they're a little bit more spicy than other times, and sometimes I need more onion or whatever it may be. And so then just mix it all up. Um, then you add a little bit of pepper. And this is to taste. I can add a little bit more later if I want more. And then we're gonna mix it all up. Let me just show you how beautiful this looks. So this is what it look, look, looks like. It's so beautiful. And it really does look like ceviche. Um, I don't know if any of you have had ceviche. Usually it's cooked with fish or with shrimp. Um, and so the way that I like to eat it um, is I grab some of these bell peppers and I just stuff them with the ceviche. Or you can just eat it in a bowl by itself. Or you can eat it with the most traditional way, which is with tostadas, but then it won't be completely raw. But you can eat it with tostadas and then have some mucho because this is my favorite um, hot sauce. It's from Nayarit. Um, and it's really good. So then you put that on top. Um, but you just stuff. Stuff your pepper with this beautiful ceviche. And then once you stuff it, you can put a little piece of cilantro just to garnish it. Um, maybe a little bit of lime zest. And I like to squeeze a little extra lime because I love lime juice. And there you have it. Your beautiful um, bell pepper stuffed ceviche. So that's my recipe. It's super simple and easy. It only took us a few minutes as you can see. And it's absolutely delicious. I hope that you enjoyed it. And um, this was my very first cooking recipe. Let me know if you like them and maybe I'll have more in the future. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!